we, Could you give us some light on what's happening? We are fishermen for the Freedom Fishermen's Park Society. We catch our fish and shocks come by the top of the plant. And what is happening from since March, the price dropped from $200 to $100 a pound present day. And the present day price we cannot hope to even the cost to catch the fish. We communicate to the Minister of Agriculture, the Chief Fishery Officer. Nobody seems to pay that everybody pay the dollar. Are we asking the government? It's just simple. Buy our fish at a reasonable price so we can survive and subsidize it. The government have subsidized the container farm is in, have the container owned in this country two point two billion dollars in twenty twenty one. We give rice farmer eighty thousand dollars per acre for the when they have flood and give them a top of billion dollar money. We give us as fishermen a hundred and fifty thousand dollars, some get an open house, some can get. Since Exxon Mobile for the fish catch is so low and we can't go. It's about four thousand households depend on the industry to survive. We don't see why the government can subsidize our, our industry, why it can subsidize the fish. Well, we actually we that for more. We came here this morning, asked to see the Minister of Agriculture. They said the Minister of Agriculture can't do what he can see us. We went to the President's office. It's the same thing that the president, we got to write the President. So we can't see them. So we don't hear protesting that somebody do something. The people in the diaspora should know. That you are so small man that you are treated in Guyana. The small man have no rights in Guyana. Excellent. What is the name of the cooperative? Three Door Fisherman Cooperative Society. Excellent. Anybody else want to talk yeah. to us? Well, actually, about three years now, the catch dropped 50%. So we asked Excel Mobile. Since they start digging the aisle, drying the aisle, the catch drop because they're disturbing the sea, so you're not getting catch. Fish gone. So now you're getting 50% of the catch, and then the price gone 50%. So actually, you know, they're not. The fisherman I got nothing to say. So the government making the money, and the fisherman just starving. So that's what I want to just ask the government if they could do something for the fisherman. We are the small man, and we going down. I just want the members of the public to understand what's happening. As a society, you are selling your fish to the government. No, no not right. a private sector. Good. Uh, Who export the fish? Good. But you're saying the government making the money and not you. Explain no, no, we're talking how. about Exxon Mobil. Okay, okay. They're okay, making okay, it. Good, good, good. I understand. Because since they start driving the iron, we don't got to catch anymore. Mm -hmm. And then the price going down. So, fisherman ain't got nothing. Mm. So what we ask in the government if they can talk to Exxon Mobile or the free or the country minister can do something subsidized to the boat owner and the workers. I just want members of the public to hear you all clearly. You're saying that the price you are spending to, to, to catch the fish is more expensive now than to sell the fish. Sell the fish. So we now make nothing. Good. So one members of the public can be very, very clear. Yeah. All right. Excellent. Anybody else want to talk to us? And in 2021, the president promised us to give a sheet house to subsidize our income. Well, 56 bodies signed up and they give six bodies. And the sheet house, what they give them was 10 by 10 square foot subsidized income. And after that, they give them 12 pound money. 56 persons apply? Uh, apply. We said that they give it the president and uh -huh. Mr. Jack Narayan Singh, who is Papa Narayan. And only six bodies get. 10 by 10 square sheet house since wow. 2021. And the president tell us in his office there, I was there with several people. Wow. He said he gets some money to spend on sheet house. Wow. Mm -hmm. Why is 10 by 10 square? What I, What was the reason you think we're only giving six persons? Well, I don't know. He said that it was subsidized the fisherman income because when Exxon Mobile came, the fish cut was so low, so we can't get So he said, okay, we got subsidized. This is your plant of garden, like. You will plant hemp, you will plant broccoli, and so on. It's a highly casting, so you will subsidize your income. But 6 out of 56, and 10, 10 by 10 school. How can a man yeah. survive it? Yeah. These people have two, three children. If they take home pay property, it's 10, 12 pounds. That can't even do nothing when you go to the market. All you have to do subsidize us until you can find market. We have the problem. No, no problem. Excellent. Who are these going to talk to? The, the chief fishery officer and the minister do, but the way you call them, 
the, the, chief, the minister put you on to the chief fishery officer. The chief fishery officer said, you know, call you back. I never know call. I call him since Wednesday up to today, you call him. Wow. They don't interest him with small money. We are small people, we are surviving in the country. I hear you, my brother. I hear you. Oh, Mr. Government, President, you got to from the better fisherman, you got the fisherman punishing. Fish price was 200 a pound. Now, fish price is 100 a pound. Expect uh, gas very dear. The cost of it is very high. Poor people are not making nothing in this country. Poor people are going every day, every day. You are sent children to school, you are not making nothing when we come. Oh, Mr. Government, you can do something better than this man, a fisherman. You can go to the supermarket for fish. You can, can export our fish. With the company, them. And they think we are okay. That, that is the one I do. Come to get a giant hands together and come together. And we can, we can move forward after that. Nothing, 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 nothing,